It's a very special honor and privilege for me to witness this epochal and historic occasion, the installation of the Oluvado of Ibado, the 42nd Oluvado in 202 years since the founding of the throne. His Imperial Majesty Oluvado of Ibado Land, Oba Dr. Senator Mohud Olale Koeshola Balogun Aliwo Ali Okumade II. Your Royal Majesty, Mr. President has asked me to convey his special and respectful felicitations to you and the royal family and the great people of Ibadan on this day of abounding joy and celebration. Your Excellency Governor Sheyi Makile, I must congratulate you as you also enter the history books, being one of the few governors who have had the joyful and historic duty of handing the staff of office to a new Olubado. Your Excellency's honored guests, we are also today participants in the remarkable history of this land of ancient renown and high achievements. Ibadan is in a real sense at the heart of the history of the Yoruba people and our nation. This is after all a town like none other, founded and shaped by defiant nonconformists warriors of major Yoruba subgroups from Moyo, Ife, Jebu, Egba, and it would become the largest indigenous city in Africa and the intellectual hub of the modern Nigerian state. Given its origins, the destiny of Ibadan as one of the political centers of gravity in our nation was practically written in stars. It was in this city that the call for Nigeria's independence from British rule first resounded. The people of Ibadan bore witness to the exploits of iconic nationalists and leaders such as Dr. Namdi Azikwe, our country's first president, and the sage Papa Chief of Bafemi Aulo, who was premier of the Western region for a time that is widely regarded as the region's golden age. Ibadan became the hub of politics in the then new nation and the capital of Western region. It was and is still acknowledged as the political headquarters of the entire southwest of Nigeria. Ibadan was and has always been a city on a hill, a place of refuge and a realm in which individuals could rise by the grace of their talents on merit and their diligence. It embodies the values of openness and diversity and high achievement. It is therefore not surprising that Ibadan is a city of many firsts, home to the first indigenous TV station in Africa, home to the Shooting Stars Football Club, the first Nigerian club to win an international trophy, the African Cup Winners' Cup in 1976. This is the home of the first university in Nigeria, and for many years, the iconic Coco House was the tallest building in Nigeria, standing as a towering edifice dominating the city skyline. A powerful visual reminder that Ibadan ceaselessly inspires us to strive for greater heights in every endeavor. But even in the management of its traditional institution, Ibadan is unerringly unique. As we all know, whoever would become an Olubadon must climb 23 chieftaincy steps from either of the two lines, as we've heard from the government, the civilian and the military. But it, it is its predictability and orderliness that ranks it among the most peaceful and unique accession protocols anywhere. It is the custodianship of this illustrious heritage and proud tradition that the Olubano has been initiated today. And it is therefore, Your Royal Majesty, a heavy obligation of history that the privilege of your accession to the throne of your fathers now places upon your shoulders. But your shoulders are broad and sturdy as you come into this office better prepared than probably any monarch anywhere with a PhD, a background in economic and social research, a scholar with an intellectual sympathy for Marxist dialectic, a university teacher, a former senator of the Federal Republic, and a champion of indigenous culture and community empowerment. 
everything in your remarkable life and times, your abiding dedication and love for the people of Ibadan, your breadth of intellect, openness of mind and largeness of heart has inexorably led to this auspicious day of your crowning as the Ulubadan of Ibadan and I'm sure will serve you well on the throne. And so on behalf of the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, President Mohamed Buhari, the government and people of Nigeria, I congratulate you on your elevation to the throne of, your, of, the, throne of the custodian and defender of the ancient cultures and traditions of the people of Ibadan, the Olubadan of Ibadan. Your Imperial Majesty Olubadan of Ibadan, I pray for you that your reign will be long, sustained with divine health and wisdom, and that this land in your reign will know great peace and prosperity, and that the talking drums will always speak celebration and thanksgiving. Kabiesi, ekwe kwe kwe funwao, kade kwe lori kibata kwe God bless you, sir.